Heroes made, not born. Except sometimes they are born. On a gloomy night in a faraway magical land called England. Ah, a giant! Ah, baby. His parents are dead, but he lives. He is the boy who lives. He has a scar on his forehead, shaped like, you know, you get it. You're familiar with this boy? Well, forget about him. Okay. This story is not about him. Ah, uh, another one. His parents also did killed in a freak chocolate frog accident. Please don't ask. This boy is whisked away to look with his uncle in the even more magical land, the Catapult Springs, New Mexico. Where the boy grows up. And up until a few weeks ago had only the regular problems of a child in 1991. Oh man. Uh, Uncle Dave, a bird just flew into our living room and dropped this piece of paper. It says, I'm a wizard and I have to go to a school in England. What kind of bird? An owl, I, I think. Oh my god! I forgot to tell you, you're a wizard, Wayne. Also, wizards exist, and you are one, just like your rich parents. Oh, and your parents are pretty. And after a confusing train station experience, Wayne found himself at the gates of a certain school of female magic and magic, where he would spend the next seven years. Tonight, we'll be taking an incredibly in-depth look at those seven years. Over the next five hours, split into two parts. What? Nine years, two minutes? Tonight, we will take a look at those seven years. Those seven years that were in one word, unfit. It begins as a story sent with a sorting. for the magic talking hat to sort me. Like, how much authority does this hat really have? I mean, never mind. This place is pretty cool. I've never been to school in a castle before. I haven't liked school that much. People were always mean to me. Never mind. I'm talking too much. You probably have your own nervous thoughts. Hey, can I tell you something? I think I might be special. I'm always watching watching movies and reading books, and it's always like a normal boy finds out his amazing abilities and is swept off into a magical world. And through some bizarre circumstances, that kid always ends up as a the chosen one. Sound familiar? That is now my actual life. Magic is real, and this orphaned boy is ready for seven years of incredible adventures. Ahem. Mr. Potter? Oh, excuse me. Oh, no, hat, not that. Anything but that. Please? Brave. Oh, another one. Um, student? Uh, Wayne Hopkins? Yes, all right. Come along, then. Puff. <laughs> the buffs. Spoiler alert, not everyone's favorite. But when a hat speaks, you listen. And the puffs were quickly whisked away to a basement somewhere near the kitchens. 
Welcome to what I like to call Year One. The Puffs and the Sorcerers attempt to earning points and making friends. Guys, guess what? We're wizards. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, we should all introduce ourselves. I'm Jay Finch Fletchley. I'm boyish and fun. Hi. Hi. I'm Susie Bones. Once upon a time, my entire family was murdered, except my aunt. Hi! Hi, I'm Wayne. I've read The Hobbit twice. Hi! I'm Sally Perks, and I go to the school. Hi! Hi. Who's that? It's me, Ernie Mac. I'm basically the best, so, hi. Hi! Hi. Uh, I was raised in a cabin by my grandparents and the first other children I've ever seen. Oh, and I'm a wizard. And my name's Leanne. Hi. Hi. I'm Oliver. I'm here to keep my head down and get a fun understanding of the wizarding basics. Hi. Hi. Um, Megan Jones. <sighs> yep, that's right. Just so we're clear, I'm not like you, any of you. So leave me alone. Hello? And my name is Cedric. Thanks. Now gather around. Don't be shy. Welcome to the Puffs. Hi! Just a few things to get you acquainted with the school. First, the stairs move. Don't freak out. Just breathe. Second, the Puffs don't exactly have the best reputation around here. People might make jokes about you. Aww. Or they might throw food at you. Aww. Or they might curse you. <laughs> in fact, here's a list of curses you can expect to be hit by in the next week. But none of that really matters. Because we're just a bunch of fun, happy people. Also, badgers. Badgers are great. That being said, there's something very important we need to talk about. What do you think the most important part of wizarding school is? Learning magic? Wrong. The house cup. Here, you can earn points for doing something right and lose them for doing something wrong. The pumps have come in last place for ever, but this year, we are going to change that. We are going to come in first, or we're going to come in second, or we're going to come in third. Third, 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 and whoever wins the most points, they'd be a real hero. Me? Maybe. Well, I'm off to bed. If Cedric's going to bed, I'm going to bed too. Jay Finch, out. Ooh, bed. Sleep. I brought my own pillow. I hope I have dreams. So it's official. The next seven years are gonna suck. Can you believe this group of things? I thought everyone seemed kind of nice. You're talking to me? You're not running away? Why would we do that? Well, everyone knows my mom worked for you know who. Who? The Dark Lord. Who? Whatever. He was a super evil wizard. There are evil wizards? Yup, and my mom was one of his most feared followers. I warn you, I'm just as awesome and scary as she is. Megan, our beds are stacked on top of each other. Magically! It's a bunk bed? We're wizards! Oh, I'm going to hang out with the snakes, where I belong. No, you'll lose points. Watch me. So you're new to all this too? Yep, all of it. My family just moved to England back in May, so they'll be close to me when I start my mathematics institute at Oxford this semester. But you're a woman. I know, I'm sort of a math savant. But none of that matters right now. Now I'm just a beginner level wizard. You don't think ending up here means I'm already bad at school, bad at wizarding, right? I'm not used to being bad at school. Don't mind that. Let's just focus on earning those points. The rest should take care of itself. I mean, how hard can it be? It's just magic.
sit. Everyone. Now. You are here to learn the art of potion making. Oh. Puffs. Bye. Now can anyone tell me what is a potion? It's the stuff you put on your skin to make it feel soft. No. That's lotion. It's the place where all the fishies live. Wrong. That's the ocean. Oh. Oh, oh, it's a starch root vegetable. That's a potato. Oh, it's the water that surrounds the continents. That is still the ocean. Uh, it's magic liquid? You are the most dunderheaded student. I have ever seen sit in my class. If you succeed in my course this year, I will eat a shoe. Ten points from the puffs. Oh, I ate a shoe once. It didn't taste good, but it didn't taste bad. Class dismissed. Configuration. The art of oh, puffs. Uh, yes, we're going to turn things into other things. Wow! Yeah, yeah. Oh, Mr. Rivers, your wand technique is all wrong. Here, you get to use the training wand. Ooh. Points from the puffs. Is there a math class? Please tell me there's a math class. Well, next up, we have something called herbology. I hope it's not scary or confusing. Class, we're going to look at plants. Okay, odd name, with the exception of herbology, which is awesome. This isn't easy. Maybe we should hide in a room for seven years so we don't lose any more points. <sighs> I mean, it is only the first day. Hey, look, we have a flying lesson next. Maybe it's time for something a bit more festive. Feast, J. Finch approved. Oliver, where have you been? Oh, sorry, I was working on my charm. I think I've got it. Thank you. points, Wayne. Everybody already hates us enough. Ugh. Let's not worry. Let's just sit back, relax, and hope nothing bad happens. Oliver, wait! Megan's not here. 
Oh no, do we need to save her or something? No. What if she's out there losing points? We have to stop her. I'm sorry, do we? It's up to us to protect those points. This is it, Oliver. This is how we become heroes. Let's go! Let's go! stuff. Oh, that's why it's forbidden. I get it. Whoa. Weird mirror. Whoa. Demon mirror. <laughs> hey, I've told you not to sneak up on me like that. Hello, fat friar. And you can just say friar. Hey, what are you doing all alone on Halloween? Shouldn't you be with your friends? Friends? You're the only one who talks to me, and... Oh, my wizard god, I just realized how pathetic that is. Ouch, my self-esteem. It's just like, come on, Mom, break out of wizard prison already and come rescue me from this stupid school. Please? <sighs> I wonder what she's doing. I think it's time to introduce you to Xavier Jones. A puff, a dark wizard. Some say few that have crossed her path have lived to tell the tale. I mean, look at her. She looks pretty crazy. Lucky for us, she's trapped in an escapable wizard prison and will probably never get out. Probably. Well, anyway, anybody up for a game of whiz checkers? Maybe those two sneaky boys want to join. Run for your life! Get out here, now! So you followed me, Hopkins? Spying on me? Trying to learn my dark, evil secrets? No, uh, we were trying to look for you. To protect you from the troll. And make sure you don't lose any more points. Do I look like I need protecting? From the two of you? Wait, a troll? Where? I want it. As a pet. Raven, this is why you don't have any friends. These two are going to get what they deserve. Hmm, what would my mom do in a situation like this? I think she'd torture you. Prepare to meet your doom. Wait, wait, what if instead of torturing us, we all hung out like friends? Excuse what? me? Yeah, go for it. I mean, we're all kind of the worst people at this school. Why not be the worst together? Megan doesn't have to be alone just because her mom was evil. Nay, I think it's pretty cool you hang out with Mr. Fryer. Hey, Mr. Fryer. I like it. Right, Oliver? Yeah, we can all hang out. Mr. Fryer, too. You promise this isn't a joke? Promise. Us pups have to stick together. I am not a pup. The hat got it wrong. I'm the most not puffiest person you'll ever meet. Got it? Yeah, got it, got it. Got it? Now how about letting us go? I guess. I dub the friends. Is that how this works? I don't really have friends. Sure. Uh, good, great. I'm glad we've gotten that all sorted out. We should probably get out of here. Oh, we're gonna lose so many points. Students lurking while a troll is about. The plants will be so disappointed. Wait, I was hunting the troll so I could shove my wand up its nose and murder it? These two friends taught me the error of my ways. Hmm. Fifty points. To the puffs. Each. The plants love life lessons. Good night. Yes. yes! Guys, we did it! I think this is the start of something really great. Whoa. Weird mirror. I'm being awarded a medal. I saved all of the wizards. I'm a hero. I'm the hero. I've officially made the puffs the best, coolest, and most important house forever. They have a lightsaber. 
I finally get it. A brand new theorem that makes differential calculus look like trigonometry for dumb dumbs. Awesome. Hi, uh, I, I, I don't see anything. Are you sure? Guys, I don't want to cut this short. Maybe we should get out of here. Yeah. What do you think that mirror is? Maybe it shows our future. That must be our future. We're going to be so cool. By the way, Oliver, where did your glasses go? We're wizards. What exactly did Miss Jones see in her reflection? Well, it's my mom. She wants to go somewhere far away. Just the two of us. The future, huh? All right. What's this? Oh, I, um, I'm sadly am obligated to inform you that this was not the only lifelong friendship forged on October 31st, 1991. Well, you two, looks like we're gonna be real good nights. Forever! You get it. Jesus, woman, I assume people. student 
could talk to snakes. First, schoolwork. What is this concoction you have made for us today, Mr. Rivers? A potion? Remedial potion will be in order this year. Transfigure this button into this beetle. What is so difficult about that? Everything. Remedial transfiguration, Oliver. History of magic. Magic history. Wizard history. Remedial history of magic. Mr. Rivers. But, but I'm, I'm a smart person. But I'm a smart person. Hey, cut it out. I'm serious, cut it out. Get away from me now. I hope something really bad happens to that kid. Yikes. Halloween arrived, and brought with it a nasty surprise. A secret chamber has been opened. There's a monster. There's a message written in blood. It's the coolest thing ever. Also, I'm into books now. Naturally, less people were excited about this. I am not excited about this. It is my job to make sure you are all educated. So... Who wants to come to Dueling Club? None of us want to end up like that poor boy who was attacked. The one with the camera. No, we certainly don't want anything to happen to him. Uh, let's get some volunteers in here. Mr. Potter? Mr. Potter? Snake spell. Ah, she thinks he's a snake. It's up to me to defeat the monster, defeat Potter, and go down as the hero of this school. Don't think you're qualified for any of that. I'll get an award. Megan, take Oliver to safety. It's definitely coming for him next. What? It's after Mugborns. You're a Mugborn, which means you're next. Oh my wizard god, what is that? <laughs> Just kidding. Wow, it's going to be a super fun year. If I get petrified, make sure I'm in a dignified position. Okay, this must be it. 
the thing I'm supposed to do to make the magic future mirror reflection of my awesome future self be my actual future. I just gotta kill a monster. I can find it in myself. Oh, uh, oh hi. Uh, oh, hi, I'm Wayne. Hey, uh, don't forget your diary. I just would like to reaffirm to you all, even in the face of a great danger, the doors to our school will always remain open. <laughs> Never mind, a redhead has been kidnapped. School's cancelled forever. Go home. Yes! Forget books! Goodbye forever, dum-dums! <laughs> Never mind, the monster is dead. Let's hear a big round of applause for the boy who fought it alone, Mr. Potter. Not fully alone. Ron helped. I'm the hero of the school. Yes, yes. Now, you all know I don't pick favorites, but Harry is my favorite. Exams are canceled. I'll see you next year. Year two. The one with snakes. The summer of 93, and our trio was determined to keep in touch the old-fashioned way, by writing two mm -hmm. copies of the same letter and mailing them out by owl across the world. Dear Megan and Oliver, this new movie just came out. It's called Free Willy. It's about a young boy's adventure to free a whale. It was amazing. I can't stop thinking about how adventures come in all shapes and sizes. I know mine is coming. I just have to find my own whale, Wayne. P.S. How does this owl know where to go? Wayne! Oliver! Big news! A mass murderer broke out of wizard prison. What if my mom sent him after me? To come and rescue me from that stupid school? I have a feeling. This year, things are going to be really serious. <sighs> P.S. The guy's name is serious. Murderer on the loose. Rut row. Lucky for us, government safety measures have been put into effect. Something that will make the children feel safe. Very safe. Safety is the name of the game this year, and year three, the puffs in pajamas because a murderer got into the school. different this year. Oh, Oliver, I'm a little more worried about the murderer coming to our school. Megan, what if he's not coming to rescue and maybe to, I don't know, murder someone? No, he's definitely coming to rescue me. And it'll be a super huge deal because this year I'll be spending my time with the Braves and everything notable that happens, happens to them. Like this guy. I'm Neville. I'm Brave. If you need me, we'll be out there being both rebellious and charming and brave. Guys, 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 come to my slaughter party. It's in the Great Hall, on the floor. But I warn you, I snore. Wanna see? We am? Oh, uh, sorry. I was having a dream I was a unicorn, except I didn't have a horn. I was eating hay. Sorry, I've got a lot going on. Ah, uh, can I think. Aw, everyone's busy. In their third year, students are allowed to pick their electives, enthralling subjects such as... Ooh, that cute job! Oh, that inner eye! Tea leaves and death. Death is coming to the world. 
Damn. What? Class is dismissed. Now, how old do you think this room is? Guess what? It's an ancient room. Is this useful in any way? Nope. Class dismissed. <sighs> no, arithmetic. Another class, I'm sure I'll fail. Welcome, class, to mug studies. Oh, now, sorry, wrong classroom. Can anyone tell me what this is? A toaster? Ooh, a smarty smart. A regular Einstein. We'll cover him later. Now, can anyone tell me what algebra is? I'd like to say in this class, please. Wait, wait, wait a minute. How is Granger in all three of these classes at once? Magic. Magic. And so, school is off to an eventful yet safe start. But all of that would change, Sean, you guessed it. Halloween! Attention, students. The headmaster is here. The murderer is in the school. He attacked a portrait and then left. Report to the Great Hall. I said now! Everyone, I've been told to inform you that it looks like we'll be spending the whole night here. Uh, Megan, you all right? I never wanted to be a puff. Every member of my family puffs. We're like the puff family. But there's nothing even special about puffs. Loyalty, being really nice. A bunch of lame, awful failures, doomed to be stupid, walking personalityless nobodies that no one will care about ever. My mom was a puff, but she was different. She became something bigger. She made the name Jones finally mean something other than a bunch of puffs. I thought, I knew I would be different too, but after all my hard work to make myself not a puff, what do you know? The hat puts me with the puffs. I did everything. I mean, I even changed my accent so I wouldn't sound like my puff family. It's not fair. Well, I for one am glad that you didn't get kidnapped by a mass murderer. Say. And I for one would like to think that maybe you've met one or two puffs that are somewhat all right. Maybe. I guess. Sorry to bring down the mood, guys. Sorry to make things so serious. She's not coming here. Ever. I feel the need to hug. Don't tell anyone. Wait. Why are we hugging? Don't, don't tell me. I'll figure it out. Hey, everyone. I'm sorry I was mean. You're not stupid. But that's okay, right? Puff hug? Puff hug. Puff hug. Puff hug. Puff hug. Attention, students. You're all safe. We think. Year three concluded. Now, you've been having a good time so far, right? I must warn you. Fate? It's never kind to a hero. But you know who they hate even more? The side characters. Dear Megan and Oliver, so, my Uncle Dave died. It was sudden and weird. Weird because I don't think anybody really cared. 
No one really knew him, but I barely even did. In the end, he was just some dead, unimportant guy. I don't want to end up like that. I don't want that to happen to me. I want to be part of something big, something important, at least once in my life. Weird. Wait. Wait, at least it's our fourth year, and you can forget about all this death stuff. Oliver. Yes, back to school, where nothing dangerous ever happens.